So how efficient is the lookup function in our ordered binary tree? If we have n words in the tree, and each node's subtrees are approximately equal in size, so we say the tree is balanced, then the average lookup time will be proportional to the logarithm of n. And we can see this easily because each time we step down from a node to one of the subtrees, if the tree is balanced, we will have removed about half of the nodes. So taking k steps down, we have divided the number of nodes we look at by 2 to the k. So this means that the number of nodes that we can remove is exponential in the depth. So this means that the average number of steps you have to take is just a logarithm. So this is much more efficient than looking up elements in a list. If we store them in a list linearly, then we have to go sequentially look at the list. So for example, if we have a thousand words in our tree and the average time is 10 time units, then for 1 million words in the tree, because it's a logarithm, this will increase to 20 time units. And for list lookup, it would increase by being multiplied by a thousand. So multiply by two is much smaller than by a thousand. But if the tree is not balanced, for example, all the rightmost subtrees are very small, the time is going to be bigger. And in the worst case, the tree is going to look like a list if all the elements are on one side. So the question is, how can we arrange for the tree to be balanced? Because that's the situation we want for this really to work. And there exist algorithms for balancing an unbalanced tree, but it's kind of complicated. But it turns out that uh, chance is on our side. If we insert words randomly, we can show that the tree will be approximately balanced and good enough that we will already achieve the logarithmic time. So that means that our tree data structure is actually pretty good.